Hey everybody, this is Nathaniel Hamill here with Behind the Glass. This is a tutorial on drawing dildos. Now, I'm using an illustration from before when I was drawing how to draw the core. We're gonna keep moving on this illustration. This is kind of fun to see the progress. With the delt, there's three parts. You have the front head, the mid, and the rear. Barely see the rear. When we have the arm in this position, you only see the front head of the delt. I I'm going to start cleaning this up. Front head of the delt attaches to the clavicle and the mid and rear head of the delt attaches to the scapula, which will be shown later on. That's satisfying. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to ink the delt. So we're drawing the delt in the three quarter front view. If you notice, the bicep goes underneath the chest. That's just a little side, side note. Now that we have the delt broken down into shapes, so from the side view, there's the mid, front, and rear. You have the side of the arm here, so you see the three parts of the delt. Then you have a trapezius, which is connected here, right between, right up at the delt. Uh, to give a point of reference, let's draw the chest. Now we can see what we're working on here with the, the mid delt. So I'm going to start coloring this in the same fashion that I colored this. I'm gonna start with the W2 and I'm rounding the shape. I'm not drawing up and down, I'm rounding it from the darkest point. Basically what is most likely gonna be shadow. Okay, and then I'm gonna go with the W5 like I did before. W7, now the W2 again, which is bleeding all that into each other. This side didn't need any W7. So then I'm gonna go with some skin tone and I'm again, rounding the shapes. So what, what that does is as you round the shape, you're, you're creating contour lines. Now I'm going to grab an N5. I'm gonna clean up some of that fuzziness. Now I'm grabbing the E11. I'm just gonna add a little bit more skin tone, a little bit warmer. And I'm just gonna add the warmth to the edges, not to the center too much. That here is the front, the mid, and the rear, rear delt. So the front delt uh, is for uh, very much like bench press, pulling forward, it's lifting up. When you're drawing a character and the character is moving in some kind of action pose, what you wanna do is you wanna think about the push and the pull of anatomy and how the muscles uh, are affected. Thank you very much for following uh, this tutorial on how to draw delts. So thank you.